Hey, I'm Brandon with Revzilla, and this is the Revit Armor Overview. So we've got a few different options from Revit to cover today. We've got C-Smart, we've got C-Flex, and we've got C-Soft. They all have their different uh, designs and advantages and different uses, which we will go over now. So you'll probably get confused with the names. I might as well. I'll probably correct myself, so bear with me. But first of all, we're going to start off with C-Smart, which is this stuff right here, aka this. It is CE Level 1 protection. It's about 20 to 25 bucks. It's flat, as you can see, but it moves very well with the body. It's very breathable, super low profile. They have this available in shoulder armor, elbow armor, knee, as well as the hip. Super low profile, very, very comfortable. I see that more in, you know, riding uh, jeans and things like that. Uh, stuff that's a bit more on the fashion side that you want to be super comfortable. Now, moving down the line, we've got the C-Flex material. This is about $40 to $45. CE Level 2 protection, as you can see here. You're going to get a shoulder, elbow, and knee with this stuff. And it comes in a few different sizes. You'll probably see RV16 quite a bit. That's the kind of standard version. And then if you take a look at RV11, RV13, those are going to be the oversized options. So if you have an older model Revit jacket, you'll probably want to stick with the RV16. If you have a newer model jacket with the larger pockets to accept the armor, you could take a look at the RV11 and RV13 stuff. It's just something to keep in mind. Pay attention to the product details. It should be well laid out there. But again, very breathable, CE level 2 protection, and I think it's very comfortable as well. Not quite as comfortable as the C Smart stuff, but that's only CE level one protection. So slightly different flavor from Revit with the C-Flex stuff, a little bit harder, still very breathable CE level two protection. Now, last but not least, we've got the C-Soft material. This right here is going to be a, a chest protector. It is CE level one protection. This is, they range in price from about $35 to up to $65 if you go with something like a back protector. The chest protection is CE level one, but something like the back protector you're often going to find is CE level two. So something to keep in mind, pay attention to the product details. As as you can see, this is a matching chest protection left and right right here, but very soft as well. It moves and bends very well with the body. It is breathable, not quite as breathable as our other two options, I would say. Now, the original, you might be used to seeing KN when it comes to this particular armor. There's the KN and there's ST, and it's designed to fit in those particular pockets and those particular shapes with Sastec as well as Knox. Moving forward, the new version for 2021 is just going to be RV. It's going to be one shape, one size to rule them all with Revit, which I think is incredibly helpful. It's going to make it a lot easier for folks shopping for back protection. We used to get that call quite a bit when I was a gear geek. You know, people would call in like, well, I don't know what back protector fits my jacket. New for 2021, they're going with that RV size, one size fits all for their newer style jackets. Thank you. Thank you so much, Revit. But that is going to be the Revit Armor Overview. Very straightforward, different price ranges, different styles, different types of fits, but there's quite a few options within their line to choose from depending on what type of protection you want, what garment it's going into, a lot of things to consider here. If you have any additional questions about this armor or what it might fit best with, please don't hesitate to reach out. Give our gear geeks a call at 877-792-9455 or simply shoot over an email, cs at Revzilla. Com. Thanks for hanging out with us for a bit, taking a closer look at this Revit Armor Overview. I'm Brandon. Keep it pinned.